Hi guys, so this is just a quick video going through some of the items that I'll be keeping an eye on in the upcoming AliExpress Summer Carnival Sale due to start on the 31st of May. As usual, I'll be leaving links for everything in the video description below. Let's get into it. So I'm actually starting off with this watch case. Um, I got one of these recently. I got it in the wine red color, as you can see here has the black leather exterior. The one that I got comes with six watch slots. Um, it's a very nice case. Um, it will be going down to £20.79p. Um, it actually has these slots here, you can see for the cushions to go into. So your watches don't slide around like they do in some watch cases. It also comes in this tan color as well. Um, I wasn't expecting much for the price, but actually the quality is very good. Yeah, I'd re highly recommend it for your watches. Um, it is quite large, so maybe not great as a, a travel case, but it's very nice to keep watches in at home. So in no particular order, I'll be starting off with this. It's the Militado ML01. I actually did a review on this watch a couple of months ago, and it's a great little watch. Obviously, it's a homage to the Boltec with the small seconds in a slightly different position and this is a quartz watch um, it's a really nice little watch with the applied arabic numerals on the railroad printed track around the outside all of the surfaces on this watch are polished um, it features a hardlex crystal and a quartz vd78 movement now the size might put some people off coming in at 36 millimeters um, but obviously if you like a smaller watch and this dress style then this is a really nice little offering from Militado. Um, it comes in an array of different colours. You have uh, silver or white and then you have this um, peachy gold colour and then the blue is the one that I went for and you can either get it on a leather strap or a rubber strap. Currently it's £56. I don't know if this will go down in the sale. But at this price, it's worth picking one up anyway because it's super cheap. Next is this Cassadin Aqua Diver, which is obviously a homage of a helm. I think it's the Komodo. Um, obviously, helms are very popular and the watches have quite a long waiting list. I think it's about two years. Um, and I'm not sure how much they are, but they have, I think, two or three hundred pounds. So if you really love the style of this watch and don't want to wait, two years to get one and then this is your best option uh, currently £59.68 dropping down to £54.96 in the sale it features a NH35 automatic movement comes in this white dial and black and orange I particularly like the white with the blue sort of applied owl markers and these chunky hands um, let's see what it comes in at so it comes in at 40 millimeters with a lug to lug of 45 and a thickness of 12.5 so it's a really good size as well i think i will actually pick up one of these when the sale kicks in it's a really good price and i was actually on the waiting list for the helm um, and when they offered it to me i wasn't in the position to buy one but i still like the look of the watch so i will probably be getting one of these next is the watch dives I particularly like the blue dial variant. Um, this is at £112 going down to £99.81. It features the NH35 automatic Seiko movement as a sapphire crystal. And uh, yeah, I think the blue looks particularly nice. This one comes in at 39 millimeters including the bezel so it's a really nice size lug to lug for 45 millimeters and the case thickness of 14 millimeters um, everything is printed on the dial I like the arabic numerals at 12 3 6 and 9 you've got those nice chunky dive style hands and uh, yeah i think this is just a, a great looking watch i haven't picked one up yet i keep on saying i will and hopefully i'll get one soon Next up is this San Martin 42mm um, Vintage Diver. It's kind of a cross between uh, Patek Philippe Nautilus and a uh, sort of dive watch. You've got that Patek Philippe dial, um, style case, but with that dive style bezel. 
and obviously you have those chunky dive style hands as well you have the applied owl markers pretty simple screw on case pack and bgw9 loom features a sapphire crystal and you have the option of two movements you've got the pt5000 the sw200 the pt5000 is 271 coming down to 211 during the sale this one comes in at 42 millimeters lug to lug is 50 thickness 13 millimeters got a sapphire crystal 120 click bezel um, 316l stainless steel bgw9 loom you've got this integrated style um, strap here i think it's just a nice looking watch slightly unusual but i think it has a cool look to it next up is this bernie um, compressor style dive watch um, it comes in a load of different colors you've got black blue green but i particularly like this sort of beige color with the blue owl markers and the orange um, zero to 15 minutes here currently 92 pounds not sure if it will drop during the sale there'll probably be some stores that will drop the ones that i have seen that are in the sale aren't in stock in the beige color but they have the others but i think the beige kind of sticks out in particular if you get it on the strap it's actually slightly cheaper as 82 pounds features um, 200 meters of water resistance it has a miyota 8215 automatic movement sapphire crystal comes in at 42 millimeters so slightly on the larger slide lug to lug is 48 millimeters and the thickness comes in at 13.5 millimeters but yes i think this this sort of beigey off-white color is really cool and these blue owl markers look nice as well and the chunky hands really finish it off i'd probably get it on the strap just to save a little bit of money and then just put it on a nice um, rubber strap or leather strap Next up, we have a new release from Hoodland. This is the Retro Classic ST1701 movement, so automatic mechanical movement. Comes in a few different colors. Um, I quite particularly like the wine red color with the printed um, off-white numerals. It has the small seconds there down at the six o'clock. You've also got black and then this sort of charcoal sunburst color comes on this nice brown leather strap um, you have this lovely coin edge bezel as you can see here which goes with the vintage style of the watch um, you can get it with the logo or without I quite like the logo it's quite tastefully done and it sticks with the sort of aesthetics of the watch it says dial diameter of 38 millimeters with case thickness of 10.4 so this one is currently 113 pounds going down to 105 during the sale this is the suges s445 chronograph featuring the st19 hand wound movement obviously it is a homage of the um, tudor chronograph um, with slight differences you have hand winding here which looks quite cool on the dial you've got sea stone chronograph comes in two different colors you've got the black and the blue BGW9 loom both look pretty cool and you've got the open case back which is a nice touch you can see that beautiful ST19 movement you've got a diameter of 41 millimeters of thickness <laughs> it says a watch thickness of 38 millimeters um, that's obviously not right um, water resistance of 50 meters it comes on this um, cool sort of nylon strap and I think it's a, a really nice looking chronograph coming in at 196 and dropping to 176 during the sale I think this is a really nice looking watch has a sapphire crystal made from 316L stainless steel the clasp is a magic nylon sticker tape <laughs> so it's just a standard um, velcro cl clasp but yeah it looks like a, a really cool looking watch and that movement is nice as well they've gone for the st manual wind movement instead of mecha quartz movement so you don't get that um, sort of useless sub dial at three o'clock you get those applied luminous hour markers which is a really cool touch i'd love to get this one in for a review 
All right, last one. This is the Suges S442, 38 millimeter chronograph. Um, comes in an array of different colors. I particularly like the white style with the uh, white, blue, and gray subdials. Actually looks quite nice on the leather strap. This one coming in at eight, uh, 186, reduced to 166 during the sale. It comes in black and blue. The blue is actually quite nice. You've got on the fly adjustment clasp. This one coming in at 38 millimeters, so it's quite a nice size for most people. Watch thickness comes in at 13.5. You got the ST1902 manual wind movement. You have the um, domed sapphire crystal. You have BGW9 loom and this lovely open case back showing that wonderful mechanical movement. So this is another one that's on my list, dropping down to just 166 during the sale. And that's all of them guys. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, I'll leave all the links for these watches in the description below. Let me know if you pick any of them up. I'll be picking up that Cassid and Helm uh, homage watch for sure. It's such a bargain coming in at just under 60 pounds. Anyway, I hope to see you in the next video guys and thank you for watching.